All right, guys, welcome back to another video of Shaman J. So I got another monitor in. This is another portable monitor. The good thing about this one is it is Type-C. I'm only using Type-C monitors now because they're just the best way to go. This is a brand new model from Lapal. This is a 2022 version. And you know that it's a 2022 version because it's a Z1 series and it also has Type-C. And they really stress that on here, Type-C. Now I've had their monitors before and none of them were Type-C. Uh, this one has now the dual function uh, Type-C with built-in speakers, a smart cover. It can be used in an external monitor for a laptop, a phone, an Xbox, a PS4, whatever you want to use it for, it could be used for that. So I already ripped the plastic off, but again, they're really pushing that it's Type-C because, you know, their other monitors that I've used were not Type-C. So let's go ahead and get it open, get it out of the box. I already cut the plastic off of it because I didn't really want to mess with all that right now i want to hurt and get into it for you so it's letting you know and also this is their newer smart cover the other smart covers that i had on all my monitors they don't have this smaller version right here where it goes into these positions so you put the monitor in the groove right there and then let you know to fold it up and then you lock it in place on that side with the logo on the outside of the cover pretty straightforward and you've got all your uh, information here for the monitor you can pause this and read it um, you can go type C into the monitor or you, and then you go type A out to type C. If you want to adjust the brightness to above 30%, please make sure the external power source is 5 volts or 2 amps. Uh, not, not all laptops or type C ports work. Uh, and if you're going to go to phone, obviously here, here, and here. If you're going to go with a laptop with an HDMI port, it tells you everything, all the different kinds of devices. There you go. So that's pretty cool. Now, let's get into a lot. I like that a lot of these monitors come with a screen protector. That's cool. It looks like they have a special red cable here for their Type C to Type A. Um, and then here's their power brick right here for that. Here's the monitor, and again, this monitor has their new, their new case, and I'll demo that in a little bit. But let's put this right here for now. And then also, they all give you a Type C cable, which you'll need. So we're going to take that out, and then here's an HDMI to Type C. It's so crazy because I just bought one of these and I <laughs> really could have used this a lot sooner. So you get that. You get some uh, things here to put on the screen protector if you want to do that. Bumpy cam. This out of the way. And uh, I'm going to show you the monitor here. So here it is right here. Some FCC branding. But you've got the controls here. This is a, a button here and a plus and minus. Uh, and then you've got your type C and then your power down here. It lets you know which is which and then there's nothing on this side So this is strictly a type C monitor unlike my other monitors um, This one has is strictly type C now I do like this right here for it being just um, a Certain specific size for the uh, magnetic case here. So that's that and then if you just take a look at the monitor itself it has a matte film which is just great and then it's a very thin monitor just in line with all my other monitors super thin uh, this one has uh, small borders around it just like this is actually a little bit smaller on the borders than my current monitor yeah this one has a little bit smaller um, borders on it from my current type C monitor so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and show you some different positions here and uh, we'll get this thing going all right, guys, so here is a sample here. I actually have it running into my MacBook Pro that's over to the left here. And I don't need any other power source but just the cable here. So the MacBook is able to power this monitor right here. And I do have it on the stand and everything here so you can see exactly the different viewing angles. It actually looks really, really solid, man. I, I like this. I'm definitely going to go ahead and use this. Uh, I'm going to replace one of the ones I have it mounted on the wall up here. 
uh, and use this one right here. Now I'm gonna go ahead and try some different scenarios here with this. So plugging it into a computer, it actually requires no other power. Now I do have the power cable that you can run in from the bottom source here, but since this doesn't require power from another source, uh, like my other monitor that I have when I hook it up to the Mac, it requires power. So let's disconnect here. No power source is going. Only thing running to this right here is just going straight into the MacBook, uh, and that is it. So I think that's pretty cool. Uh, I love Type C monitors that don't require extra power when hooking up to a MacBook or anything like that. So let's try some different devices and see if I have to hook up some power to them. All right, now I'm going to go ahead and plug up an S22 Ultra, and if your device has DeX, it should turn it on. There we go. Dex working with these, nothing but the, you see the bottom port here is for power and I have nothing going on. This is like the ultimate monitor right now. And then if I swipe down on the top here, I can control my Dex with this right here. You can see the mouse is right there. You can see me moving it around right there. Uh, this is a win, man. This monitor is a win. Um, I am telling you, this is a major win. Having monitors like this at Type-C that don't require external power are always going to be a win. So I can tell you right now, uh, I'll leave a link to the description right now. There's going to be a, a discount down there. You can probably grab some, grab some more money off as well. So uh, I'll probably be doing a giveaway soon as well. So stay tuned and stay locked to that. Like this video, share it, do whatever you need to do to get the numbers up so we can get a giveaway going. This is absolutely incredible. A Type-C monitor that's strictly Type-C, no other ports, works perfectly fine with external power only. Ah, I love it. It's your man Jay, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.